Welcome back to Martino TV. Many of us dream of starting our own business, but don't know where we would get the money to start. So today, Tom visits with a nonprofit that's helping people just like you start the business of their dreams. I have two unusual things to talk about today. I'm at Quacker's Gift Shop. The gift shop's unusual. They, they specialize in rubber ducks and bath and body essentials. And the other unusual thing, how they got their funding and how you can get your funding for small businesses. So we'll talk about that first with Lisa Adams from Axiom, which means action. Now, I don't understand you guys because it seems too good to be true. <laughs> You're a nonprofit organization or corporation. Mm -hmm. And what's your main purpose? To support small business owners through access to capital as well as other services such as mentoring. Mentoring is very important. You help them, you give them ideas, you hold their hand through growth. But the funding part, you know, we, we used to talk about funding as venture capital and as a joke we called it vulture capital. <laughs> because usually somebody wants something, but you guys are nonprofit and you truly want to help business. That's right. Where'd you get your start and why? Well, um, there's, there's obviously a need currently, yes. right now especially, for small business owners who are unable to access capital through traditional lending sources. Right, because banks don't like lending to business. They don't. And, and you loan the people here money to grow their inventory and their market. Mm -hmm. So what is the angle? Why, why was it started? And just give me a little background of Axion. It's a wonderful organization. Well, the purpose really is to, to support and strengthen communities by helping the small businesses that, that really make up that community, that provide employment, um, that you know sell your, your bread down the street, yeah. that provide all the services that we need on a daily basis. How do you find out about businesses that need help, or how do they find out about you? Well, we have a couple of different sources. We have a lot of community partnerships, um, organizations. That refer people to you? Exactly. Mm -hmm. um, as well as banks actually do refer people to us as well as Who's, current clients. Who started it? Uh, Axion New Mexico, Arizona, Colorado um, was started by Ann Haynes Yaskwitz in 1994 in Albuquerque. For the so. purpose of helping small business. Exactly. It sounds like such a great goal, and it's nonprofit. But where do you get your funds then to loan? Our funds actually come from three different sources. So um, donations from foundations and grants, uh, as well as a lot of our clients actually, when they become successful, donate back to us. And the final lending source would be from we take out loans from banks as well and then reloan the money mm -hmm. and then you guys make money in order to stay in business through your loans but but they're not they're not abusive loans they're very friendly loans right. very very economic loans mm -hmm. and it's just enough to stay in business you don't have exactly. big profits and big stockholders it's not a bank mm -hmm. and what are some of the gratifying stories like here what did you do here uh, this is a great story. So uh, we helped Jennifer Brown um, with uh, increasing her inventory so she could actually move into a store location and, and get started uh, because of the popularity of her product. She's an amazing entrepreneur. So. Now, are people finding out about you? I mean, because it seems like such a dream come true for small business. Are more and more people finding out about you? That's been one of our biggest challenges because we do have money to lend and we are actively lending and, and really the challenge is getting the word out there that, that we have this money available to small business owners. That's amazing. You have to get the word out there because people don't know about it. Mm -hmm. So we're going to help you. Great. Because it's nonprofit, it's made to help small businesses, and in addition to lending money, they help you pay it back by growing your business, giving advice, counseling, marketing ideas. Mm -hmm. It sounds too good to be true. Let's talk to one of the owners of this store directly benefiting. Okay, so it all started here. Jennifer Brown is the owner of Quacker Gift Shop, and this is where it started? This is where it started, Tom. You started, you do bath and body stuff, mm -hmm. and you had a product, a soap embedded with a duck? That's how it all started. We thought it was cute to put a little duck in our soap. Um, in the beginning, we were going to a few festivals a year. We started with about 20 of these, but as we talked to our customers, they said, is there any chance we could just get the duck without so, the soap? So you start selling ducks. 
We started selling ducks. And based your business around ducks? Yes, we did. So were you crazy or did it work out? At the time, we thought we were a little crazy, but it worked. And let's talk about that. Look at this wall. You sell so many ducks. I mean, where did you find all these? We buy from 47 vendors around the world. So we spend our day looking for ducks for, to sell in our store and on our online business. And so you do ducks, and of course, you make your own bath and body essentials. Yes, we do. Can we see some of those? Because they're very beautiful and uh, natural and made here locally. You make your own right here in Colorado. Right in Inglewood, yes we do. Now what do you have? What kinds of products do you have? So this is how it all started. This is a loofah embedded in soap and we like to say that they're a soap with a purpose. Yeah, and a little abrasive. Yeah, so in the shower, in the bath, and everybody has flip-flop heels, so you get this slick edge and you get a rough edge and it actually works. That's pretty cool. And how did Axion help you? Well, in the beginning, um, we we knew that we were going to have a, that we were going to be moving and that uh, we were going to be advancing in the world of rubber duck, but we didn't know how to increase our inventory so that we could increase our profitability. You went to a regular bank? Yes, we did. What did they say? No dice? Uh, N O, capital N O. Yeah. So what happened? How did you find out about Axion? So we were we were working very closely with the SBDC. And, and the SBDC is? Small Business Development Corporation. Corporation. Thank and you. what happened? Yeah. Um, Jim Ulp, we were working with Jim Ulp at the time, and he said, there's a new, a new uh, nonprofit in town. Uh, let's get you in touch with them. We we're like, oh, here comes another no. Well, it was a complete opposite. So when you met them, what, did, what were you surprised about? how excited they were about our business. They saw how we were growing, we saw how they were growing in the community, and how we had a viable business. And they took a look at our total package, um, not just... The bottom line. The bottom line, the credit score. Right. Um, they were interested in seeing us build a business here in Colorado. How have they helped you? A loan for money, what else? So it, it went far beyond the loan for money. We did get 100% of, of what we needed to increase our inventory levels, but beyond that, the mentor program, the, um, the ongoing counseling and help with our financial picture, they're there for us. They're there for, do, do you need an attorney to look at your business structures? Do you need accounting? How can we be here for you? And they're, they're always emailing. Would you like to have lunch? How can we help? What can we do for you to continue to build your business and become even more profitable? Like a partner. Like a partner. That is cool. And so tell us more about the store and about your products. Uh, you mentioned something here you really love and you sell tons of this. Talk about that. This is our our body butter. This is an amazing product. This is shea butter, honeysuckle essential oil, and we changed our product design a little bit when our customer said, we love this product, but we want it on our heels. We want it on our elbows, so we put it in a roll-up. So you a roll-on, so you can put it anywhere yeah. you want. Yeah, um, we sell thousands of pieces of this. This is one um, beyond the, the loofah. This is our second best-selling product. And of course, you have your ducks. Okay, so Axion was able to help you expand. It can help other small businesses expand. The organization is nonprofit, and they are there for small business in both funding counseling, marketing help, mentoring. Find out more about it right now. All right, Axion, New Mexico, Arizona, and Colorado. You can call them through.